hello guys good morning and welcome back to my channel if you are just stopping by for the very first time you are definitely welcome here and if you are a returning subscriber thank you very much and please subscribe to this channel if you haven't done so yet and turn on the notification bell so you can be notified each time there is an upload coming from me today guys i'll be teaching you how to activate how to make turmeric oil and how to activate it to get that flawless and lightening effect that you want to get on your skin and of course if you want to use this this turmeric oil orally because hope you know turmeric is medicinal as well it treats a lot of health this it has a lot of health benefits if you would want to see how to activate it so, so you can be able to get this benefit and why you should even activate it because you might just be using your turmeric on your skin and not seeing the effect because it's not working you have not done the right things if you want to discover that little secret like i told you keep watching and please subscribe to this channel because i'm gonna be teaching you a lot of stuff on this channel and let's jump right into the video to see the ingredients we're going to be using to achieve this wonderful yes guys i like i said we're going to be making our turmeric oil and i'm going to be showing you how to activate it a lot of people or some people say turmeric doesn't work for them they hear others raving about turmeric being a lightening oil a brightening oil or very helpful in other health issues but if they don't get that result and they keep wondering why it's simply because you have been doing the wrong thing so we have to correct some of those mistakes in this video and the very first ingredient you would be needing of course is your turmeric and this is what I'm going with today but on a normal day I will go with the roots I already have my turmeric oil you can go with the turmeric roots the fresh roots you just buy them peel, peel off the skin if you want to if you don't want to use the skin they make sure they wash them very well let them be clean and you just slice them and do the recipe with it but i'm going with the powder today so we will be needing the turmeric powder and what make sure you're buying you're buying the organic if you want to use go with the powder make sure you're buying the organic don't buy powders that have additives added into them and then what we actually need to activate this turmeric is this this is this is black pepper yeah this is black pepper a lot of people just look at black pepper as a spice but it's actually also very good for the skin both turmeric and black pepper have key active ingredients that contribute to their anti-inflammatory and antioxidants and disease fighting qualities so black pepper is also good health wise and even topically when applied to the skin it gives your skin it gives you a very beautiful skin it fights inflammations also and the most active ingredient in, in turmeric that we will as our base spice for today the oil we're making we're making from turmeric turmeric oil the, the the very active the most active ingredient in turmeric is called curcumin however the problem with this curcumin in turmeric is that it is not easily absorbed by the body so there is a need for you to activate it with black pepper black pepper contains bio the bioactive compound called piperine or piperine like some people call it it helps to relieve nausea it helps to relieve headache it helps it helps with poor digestion and that is why from my studies and research i have come to realize that black pepper is used in it is very effective in weight loss if you want to lose weight i'll be showing you a recipe on how to use black pepper to, to lose weight if you're interested in that leave a comment below and i'll do that for you guys so like i was saying piperine that is the the, the 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 black pepper contains bioactive compound which is called piperine or piperine and it helps to relieve nausea it helps to relieve headaches poor digestion and it also has anti-inflammatory properties i hope you're getting the sense out of this but the most significant benefit of black pepper that we will, that is our concern for today is that it has the ability to boost the absorption of turmeric so whether you are taking turmeric orally without black pepper added into it your blood cells don't accept it your blood doesn't absorb it so easily but when you add black pepper into it you are going to activate it and that is why you hear some people say they are they are turmeric they, they drink turmeric oil or turmeric what it doesn't work i mean the ones they do at home because those guys in the industries they know what they are skincare skincare industries they know what they are doing 
and they know, they know how to do it the right way but those of us who are doing diys sometimes we don't have these tips and we don't get the real results and that is why i'm here to show you this so we will be doing the double the double boiling method today because we really want to avoid heat as much as possible so this is my pot i'm gonna turn on my turn on my fire oh excuse me i'm gonna be turning on the fire and we're going to be doing the double boil, double boiling method so you need a glass bottle for this you need a glass bottle and and let me pour my up my water this is my water this is hot water it was already boiled let me just pour it there and boil it so it could make this video not to be too long that's my water and then this is a glass bottle where we are going to be putting our ingredients so the very first thing you want to put in is turmeric i already told you turmeric is very good aside its anti-inflammatory properties it's good in skin lightening skin brightening it helps with acne if your your skin is going through a lot you can add turmeric into it it doesn't bleach your skin guys now some people will start coming for me oh my god i'm gonna have some hell doing this let me let me just get this so i don't I don't just like to work with turmeric too much because this is one tablespoon. I'm putting it in my in my glass jar, and this is another tablespoon. Two tablespoons is going to be is going to give you about forty grams of turmeric. So this is it, and then you need uh, you need a, a, a an oil to use. You need an oil to use. Now the oil you will be choosing to make this this oil the depending on where you want to apply your turmeric oil if you want to apply it on the skin then you need on your body you you can use go with coconut oil you can go with almond oil you can go with olive oil but if you want to apply it on the face guys make sure you go with sunflower oil this is sunflower oil because it's good for the for the face and the skin coconut oil clogs the pores and so on but today i am going in i have this carrot oil that i already made that's what i'm using as my base oil Just because I'm saving my sunflower oil for something else. And I already have, like I said, I already have turmeric oil at home. I'm just using this. So this is it. You pour in your oil until it covers the turmeric. It covers the turmeric. I think it's not enough. I'm going to add a little bit more. Yeah. Then you stir. You want to stir. You want to stir this. Stir it very well. Then now... You want to put it in the pot. This is our pot. So we are doing our double, double boiling method. That's our pot. I'm going to drop down the heat because I don't want this thing to be overheated. I'm going to drop down the heat. Let's see. Could I add? Maybe I should add a little bit of oil. Now you pour in the oil and keep stirring until it has a beautiful consistency. There's really no measurement for this because it depends on how for the oil it depends on how much you oil you want to have and now the measurement just comes in with the black pepper now in 400 in 40 grams of of turmeric powder i will be making use of about 400 milligrams of of uh, black pepper which is going to activate our turmeric to boost the absorption of the turmeric into on into uh, into the body it makes it you understand what i'm trying to say so i'm gonna add this into my turmeric this is it this is my turmeric here in the cup i'm gonna add it inside and then i will stir so i'm going to keep it under this on this low heat for i'll be stirring it from time to time and i'll let it sit here for about 15 minutes and then i'll extract the oil yes guys so we have had our turmeric cooked on the fire or double boiled on the fire for 15 minutes and it's time to bring it out and sieve it now i just want to show, give you an idea of how low my fire is you see it's very very low very low so i'm putting up turning off my fire now and then and then bring out my turmeric this is it this is it bring out my turmeric Make sure you don't tie the bottle, the cup, don't, don't cover it so hard, so you don't cause any explosion or anything. So this is my turmeric that has been on the fire, and it's about time to sieve it out. Now you can use a cheesecloth. A cheesecloth is actually the best. 
but I'll be going with this sieve, which is not the best way, but use a cheesecloth cloth to do this and it's a bit hot oh my gosh yeah it's a bit hot when you use a cheesecloth you just get just the oil and the the the, the chaff or the powder is going to be left so this is it this is how it looks like this is how the oil looks like and then you put it in a bottle but like I said make use of turmeric roots that's actually the best so you avoid all these greeny greeny stuffs this is good it's always better if you want to drink it but if you want to apply it topically go with the turmeric roots it's actually the best so you avoid those grains inside trying to go through the stress of sieving too much so but if you if you don't have it and you have this at home you can make use of this but try to get a cheese cloth in to to sieve the oil and then you put it in your bottle and that that's good to go this is it this is how it looks like this is the oil put it on my skin this is it so that is it and i hope you enjoy this video and i hope you learned something the, the um black pepper or the piperine piperine trick to be added into the turmeric in order to boost it now try this recipe at home and let me know how it goes and please share my videos with your friends and comment leave a comment below if you enjoyed this and leave a comment on what you would want me to talk about on this channel and of course give it a thumbs up so thumbs up if you enjoyed it and until next time i will see you bye bye